Hello everyone, it's Dmitry Anoshin in Surfalytics and this is introduction for Model 5, Fundamentals of Cloud Computing. I'm here in beautiful Cox Bay in Tofino, BC. We just finished our surfing uh, bootcamp where we spent five days. We learned surfing, we, we talk about professions, data jobs and job searching and some tools and technologies, but it was very fun. So we definitely will do it again. The Model 5 is the fundamentals of the cloud computing. So right now, the cloud computing skills is a baseline skill for almost any job, even non-technical. Even product manager, project manager, they all work day to day with cloud computing we trade. It's the same as probably 20 years ago, everyone should know Microsoft Office. Now everyone should know the cloud computing. So this particular model, Model 5, will be covering fundamentals of cloud computing. It will be totally vendor agnostic. And then we'll dive deep into AWS and Azure and a bit of Google Cloud. And for the last four years, I'm teaching cloud computing in the University of Victoria. That is the same place as Tofina on Vancouver Island, just different city, so basically right there. Yeah, and this is the Pacific Ocean, by the way. And we probably, on the other side is the open ocean, on the other side is uh, Japan. Back to the cloud computing, we'll learn about cloud service models, cloud deployment models, we'll try a lot of different services. And our main focus will be the cloud services that really related to the data jobs. So we'll learn about networking, we'll learn about security, privacy and compliance. And as usual, we have lots of hands-on. All the skills that you already learn in model two, three, four about BI, ETL and databases, you can apply this in cloud. Anything you built on your local machine now, you can build in the cloud. Especially it's related to the container. So for example, if you want to deploy any service in the container, then you can now deploy the service in the cloud. And this will be very interesting. For example, we'll take the DBT and we will try to deploy it in the container. For example, we can take Azure Kubernetes services or Azure Container Service and deploy DBT there. We can add Airflow for orchestration. We can use Metabase as open source, so we can maybe take the managed service of Looker and connect to the database and many other things. This is actually the really, really dive deep in the cloud computing and you will benefit from this. Don't forget to like and subscribe.